Okay. With being on the floor, I almost thought it was another challenge rune, but since it wasn't saying use rune. Uh, did I miss a teleporter? That I could have used to get back up a lot easier. I know there's lore in that room, I don't care. <laughs> Which is one thing I will say Dead Cells has not sold me on is the lore aspects to it. Which is probably why I fell off of it. thing as long as you're f crashing to the ground you're not gonna get stunned when you would fall from a large height as long as you're crashing to the ground and doing the slam if you're just falling you're gonna end up stunned at the bottom you actually wait Teleport. and run all the way back up Another one. Finding a decent number, surprisingly. Okay, that just leads to that. Are they connected to me? Will they not do shit? If I'm too far away? Um... Better DPS. 50% damage when max health. Fighters crawl from the dead, which is basically swarm. Um... Cause bleeding. And 35% plus damage. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go with it. I think it's just better. And still my old one. And my constant forget things is sell the old shit. Why? Why? It is literally in my way. And 
and my method is usually just hit it till it dies. I can't. Down. Still no black ridge. Where is it? Mary, I still haven't figured out for the life of me. Like, I know in the promenade where that the exit is always at the end of the area just keep going right not a thing i learned for this one like, i don't know if it's after the third tower or it's guaranteed or something I also really hit the shield dudes there it is it's gotta be here Really, the only thing I know is once you hit the elevator. Uh. Yeah, definitely not getting that. Didn't expect to get that. I have 29. Oh, uh, I'm so tempted, but I'm gonna stick to my guns and focus on that. There's only one other thing I'm focusing on that I don't have the option to in there. And if I can beat the boss, I will potentially show it. Um, ammo. Ooh, I am going in with a risky setup right here. I have not used either any of these. Maybe the blood sword, but not in any successful run have I used a blood sword. The concierge. This is what I do. Like all day. And basically just let him kill himself. <laughs> or let my minions kill him. But the heavy crossbow does good work. At least, at the very least, I've learned the moveset. Swarm is super helpful against ground enemies. It literally just doesn't stop. Oh, yeah. I don't want to keep Swarm all the time. Especially on this kind of run. This is what I one of the traps I would normally use. 
And I think I'll get rid of the grenade for it. Yeah. Weapon I thought I would like, have not liked. It's a little slow. I hate this area. Now Slumburn Sanctuary. I've only been there once. But it wasn't from this. This is the other place I need to upgrade. I only got 12 in that run. Ah, oh, investing cells permanently increase the drop rate of high volumes. This is the other one that's going to take forever. Because you only get that one after defeating bosses. And basically, I dump all my bosses into it. I can't get to the slumbering sanctuary through this route just due to. You <sighs> need ball drum. And the reason I've been to it in another way is because you can get to it after defeating the ancient sewer boss or the boss after the ancient sewers which I think there's only one it's kind of like the black bridge where there's only one option of where you're going next actually having swarm might be helpful in this area because there's basically enemies that put a swarm on you. Those guys. And I hate them. I also hate these guys. So, have more of my monsters. There you go. Entrance, cross. Ah. They're still going at it. God damn it, God damn. Well, help them out. Come on. Up. Mm, nope. Probably should have looked at what, if any, little bits it had. And I don't- Oh, I did have the village key? Wow. What the fuck? Not sure how you did that from a level of below me. There's another one above me. Okay, no. 
gotta figure out how to get to. Damn it. It is such a bloodbath right now. Some of it is mine, and I don't like that. That's how. Um, five, six, five. I'm so now just second guessing how I'm doing this. But at the same time, like I said, I've gotten farther in this than I have ever recently. Like, I only saw this yesterday for the first time. So in comparison to how I was doing, I'm doing phenomenal. Getting to the Black Bridge was a maybe. Almost there. If I can get through the clock room, clock tower, yeah, clock tower, might be able to. Do I want to spend the money to upgrade? I want to spend the money to upgrade you, yes. 100% damage to poison targets, no. 30% damage to burning targets and victims burn when they die. So, have a crowd. They kill one, create burn. And do more damage to others, which creates more burn. Ah, so good. Um, 30% damage to a burn. Alright. Let's up you. Bye, you're crafting dead. I'm basically just creating swarms all over the place right now. My sword creates it. I literally have a bomb that makes them. And now my, even my freaking bear traps make them, basically. It's a pretty good, pretty good one. I don't know if I'll be the clock tower boss. I don't have much confidence in going against one, but Swarm has not been failing. So I will put faith in Swarm. Uh, don't put- Oh, you put me in a crappy place. You! Did you kill my Swarm? Thank you. 